Oh my wow, who knew Beck was such a good slide player? I didn't, but I was watching the live version of this song, Loser, of course, uh, BBC Sessions. I'll put the link to that in the description so you can check it out too. It's crazy, but luckily we don't have to do anything that crazy. What we have to do is really easy. First, put your guitar in drop D. Quick way to do that if you're not feeling too exacting on that particular moment is play a D chord and then pluck your E string and tune it down until it sounds right. Pretty good, all right. Then take your slide. If you don't have a slide, that's okay. Just use your finger. Pluck your D string, your now D string. Slide up to somewhere in between five and seven-ish. And then when you get there, abandon ship and play the open D string. So. And then do it again. And then you're gonna play the D the A and the D strings on the seventh fret with your slide and go down. In the town of how he does that and slide at the same time, I do not know. But anyways, there it is. There's most of the song. Great! The other part, let's practice the notes on our B and our E string. It's do 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 So, uh, D is the third fret of the B string. D, D. My mom had a friend named D.D. D.D. E. D. F sharp, that's the second fret of the E string. D. E. D. Alternating with D. D. E. D. F sharp. D. G. D. G is the third fret of the E string. That's it. That's how you play Loser by Beck. That, that is it. That is the third shortest video in the world. Okay. Uh, yeah, everybody, thank you for your votes. That was really fun. I think we'll do that every few weeks, maybe once a month, whenever I just feel like uh, we need to put our tentacles out into the universe and see what, what other directions we might go in. At any rate, thank you for being here. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time with more stuff. Back to our regularly scheduled programming next time. Goodbye.